So it is that time again, the time where perhaps well, the day the game is back. Bigger, better, bolder. This surely has to be the ultimate uplift, the pick me up for every inhabitant of the land. The football season starts again here. Oh, the pre match build up has been fantastic. Now, the game itself. Top flight football, how England has missed this. Seen by many as perhaps the most competitive, the most demanding of all of Europe's great leagues. Well, it is the league which arguably has the best players and the best managers. Its strength is evident through the fact that English clubs are, are so prevalent in the latter stages of European competitions as well. Which means, yeah, it probably is the world's most followed league. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Rashford, out to the left it goes. Yeah, that works for me, the denial of movement, blunt and, and brusque. Good spot, he's seen the run. Interesting ball, and he cuts out the supply. Casemiro. Yeah, I've had a quick review of what we've seen so far, and I can confirm we're in a shot-free zone. Can he latch on to this? He is through here. Shot, real chance. Goal, Manchester United. Manchester United take the lead. Yeah, the right touch in moments like that is key to what follows. All very neat and tidy. Manchester United draw first blood here. I'll oh, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Gets away from his opponents. Gabriel Jesus. Saka. For Fabio Vieira. Barrios. Rashford producing a good steal there. Showing a good level of alertness. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes, who set up one goal so far. Oh, no joy this time. Well, that tackle was certainly sturdy. Martinelli. Tomiyasu. Fabio Vieira. Petit really struggling to influence the game. They're just trying to negate his influence, and it looks like whatever it takes. There will be one minute added time. Foot in, yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And we hit half-time, steady, solid, and for now, where they want to be. Just one goal, and they have it. Good effort from both sides, but at half-time, it is 1-0. So well, it hasn't exactly got the plan so far, but there's no need to panic. There's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. Substitution for Arsenal, number seven, coming on to replace him is... And the second half gets on the way. Arsenal don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Saka. Spread out to the left. Diogo Dallo. Arsenal do appear to have made a half-time change. Well, I think this is probably a good time, Peter, to make ambitious change. Trossard. Petit. Now it's Gabriel Jesus. Rafael Varane. 
They'll buy a goal, needing to go up a gear. That's how it looks here. The attendance for this match was 71,550. That's good play. Fiddles it through. Whatever happens, that's the kind of movement which raises hope. And now the breakaway. Petit running with the ball. Martinelli. Oh, good spread. Arsenal are definitely going about this the right way. This is a really front-footed approach. Well, the question now is whether they can sustain it. Lindelof. And it's Casemiro. And that interception was most necessary. And now they can clear their lines. Gabriel Jesus. Well, it didn't look good for a while, but that was brave defending, and they got away with it. Oh, that's brilliantly defended, though. It looked destined for a goal. Bruno Fernandes. This is actually quite a courageous move, and I lad, ambitious and adventurous too. Well, the ball's gone astray. Manchester United surely have to be commended for their drive and desire. Most teams would be taking the easier defensive route by now. Played out wide, well read, and the danger is averted. No messing about, just bludgeoned the way. Final ball not quite right, and his teammates are irritated at that. Bruno Fernandes. That looks a cracking ball. It's a pretty loose pass. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just they need to manage this to time. secure the win now. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Arsenal have tripped at the first hurdle here, nothing to show yet, but plenty of time to recover. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Listen, nobody wants to open a new season in, in this fashion.